right, let's see what the fine folks at Bridge Column Systems have sent me. They sent me a Anytone AT-D878UV2+. Let's see what's in the box here. So we get one, but two stickers. We get a coupon code and just some disclaimers. Um, if there's any questions or issues, do not return. And we also get a uh, owner's manual. So here is the radio itself. Let's get this thing opened up. Kind of hard to do with just uh, one hand here. So we'll put that down. Actually not a bad size. Fits in the palm pretty good. The knobs seem very tactile. Got some good weight with it without uh, even the battery into it yet. This has got the GPS and the Bluetooth. Let's see what else is in here. Looks like I got a uh, program cable, USB-A to USB-C and USB. Velcro, the wall wart for the charger, Bluetooth PTT, belt clip. Uh, here is the wall uh, charger, lanyard. The antenna. And last but not least, we have the battery. So let's get this thing opened up. Everything's packaged very well, very nice. So here we go. Click it in. Nice, no wiggle, no movement. Fits very nice in the hand. Go ahead and uh, put the antenna on. And then we'll see this together for the first time. It's asking me to do a bunch of calibration and stuff. I'm gonna to wait to do that when I program it. Um, I still have to download the drivers so I can actually get my repeaters and my local DMR groups into it. I've been watching a few videos here and there. Um, doesn't seem like it's gonna to be uh, too hard. And like every good radio, what was the last thing we do? We peel off the protective screen. Yeah, don't be that guy. If you guys want this radio, and kind of follow along with what I do and kind of learn this as we go. And if you have this radio, this comment for some tips and tricks, you can find a link in my bio that will take you to uh, the website. Full disclaimer, I get a little bit of a commission off of it. it. Doesn't change the price for you, but it helps me out so I can keep doing these videos. These things take a little bit of time. And is if you are already in the hobby or just starting out, you understand that these things are can get quite expensive. So if you feel like you need to, don't uh, obviously you're not required to and don't feel obligated, but it would help me out quite a bit just for here and there.